Once upon a time, in a tranquil village nestled amidst the lush green hills, there lived a wise Zen teacher named Master Lai. He was known for his solitude and deep understanding of life's mysteries. Master Li resided in a small temple surrounded by a serene garden where flowers bloomed in harmony. One chilly winter day, the peaceful ambience of Master Li's temple was interrupted by the arrival of four wandering monks seeking shelter and warmth. They knocked on the temple's wooden door and with warm smiles, Master Lai welcomed them inside. The four monks bowed in gratitude and expressed their desire to build a fire in the temple yard to alleviate the cold. Master Li graciously granted them permission, and as they gathered wood for the fire, a lively discussion arose among the monks about the nature of reality. The first monk, Zi, spoke confidently. In the world of Zen, everything is an extension of the mind. Thus, the stone before us is a projection of my thoughts, making it exist inside my mind. The second monk, Bai, contemplated for a moment and replied, I understand where you're coming from, dear brother. But from my perspective, the stone exists independently of our thoughts. It is an objective reality, external to our mind. Listening to their debate, Master Li approached the group with a calm demeanor and asked, My friends, tell me, what purpose does this debate serve? Zi replied, We seek to understand the true nature of reality and the essence of existence, Master Li. The wise master smiled gently and said, Ah! The nature of reality is as elusive as the morning mist. Let me offer you a tale to ponder. He began. Once there was a traveler who carried a heavy stone in his backpack wherever he went. The weight burdened him greatly, and he struggled to find peace and joy in his journey. He believed the stone was an inseparable part of him, trapped within his mind. As he traveled further, he encountered a kind sage who observed his troubled spirit. The sage, with a soft voice, asked, why do you carry such a heavy burden on your journey? The traveler replied, This stone represents the worries and troubles of my life. It weighs me down, and I cannot rid myself of its presence. The sage nodded thoughtfully and said, Have you considered setting the stone down and embracing the freedom of lightness? The stone is not an inherent part of your being. It is merely an illusion, a creation of your mind. As the traveler contemplated the sage's words, a realization dawned upon him. With newfound clarity, he unburdened himself of the heavy stone, leaving it behind. As he walked away, he felt liberated, no longer imprisoned by the weight of his thought. Master Li paused, allowing the essence of the story to sink into the hearts of the monks. My dear friends, he continued, the stone is but a metaphor for our attachment to subjective views and the burdens we carry within. The true nature of reality is beyond the confines of subjectivity and objectivity. It is a dance of interconnectedness, where thoughts, emotions, and the external world blend harmoniously. Zi and Bowie exchanged understanding glances, their minds opening to a broader perspective. The other two monks, Yu and Jaya, also absorbed the profound wisdom shared by Master Lai. From that day forward, the four monks understood that their perceptions were like fleeting ripples on the surface of a vast ocean. The stone in the temple yard became a reminder to embrace the beauty of existence without clinging to rigid notions. As the fire warmed their bodies, the fire of enlightenment warmed their souls. And so, the temple remained a place of learning where travelers sought not only shelter from the cold, but also refuge for their restless minds. In the embrace of Zen wisdom, the monks learned to carry the lightness of being, leaving behind the weight of subjective judgments, and in their hearts they found the true warmth of inner peace, which illuminated their path as they continued their journey through the wondrous tapestry of life.